Hey everyone, it's Lily from WED TV here to dish about episode 11 of this season's The Bachelorette. The most dramatic Bachelorette finale yet may actually be the most dramatic. It definitely topped the Mesnick fiasco from last season, but in a romantic kind of way. If you missed last night's episode, here's the superhero recap. The superhero recap. Kipton and Ed get grilled by Jillian's mom, but both come out with flying colors, with Ed asking Jillian's father for her hand in marriage. Kipper is the first to the altar, pours out his heart, and gets rejected. Up next is Reed, yada yada yada, he gets rejected as well. And finally, there's Ed, who puts a ring on Jillian's finger. The superhero recap, brought to you by the Mankini. Get yours today. So she didn't pick Kipton, and we saw his heart destroyed on national television. Didn't we say he was going to be the next Bachelor? How did we know? Well, our first clue was that Kipton does so much charity work, but we've only seen a glimpse of it, meaning they're saving their A-material Kiptonite for the hearts of Kipton's growing female fan base. Get ready to melt, girls. ABC is taking applications now. You better get in line. Jillian said no to Wes, and he would write her a song. Jillian said no to Jake, and he would charter a plane in a heartbeat for her. Reed, I love you, but you showed up in a taxi wearing a charcoal suit and white sneakers. You're not just in Timberlake. To pull off a comeback like that, you gotta be flawless. Ed, we knew you had it in you. We saw that chemistry from the very first episode, and we're glad you dropped to one knee to propose to Jillian. From your green mankini to your drunken jig, you definitely gave us some memorable moments. So I'm very happy to give you the line of the week. Line of the week! So we were going to give it to Jillian for after she eliminates Reed and mumbles under her breath, Ed better not f***ing disappoint me, but we decided to get romantic and give it to Ed instead. For when he asks, I need to know, do you love me? Ed, your charisma and genuine character make you the perfect pick for Jillian. I even see a little bit of Canadian in you, and if you ever decide to move to Canada, you will definitely fit right in in Van City. I'm one Canadian with undoubtedly many others who is truly rooting for Canada's newest engaged couple. So Jillian has picked her man, and we're wondering, could she pull a Mesnick and choose Reed in the end? Log on to theringbearer.ca. We're chatting on the forum, and we want to know, who would you have picked?